These shots are insane, though. Like, imagine hitting those shots. Imagine being Jing, dude. Damn, skipping and Twitch VODs are so slow. <laughs> Sorry. You actually always jump those at nade? Or maybe it's specifically for when they come out long. I'm gonna check the minimap again. Oh yeah, it's specifically when he's trying to hit the guy long, I think. He aims lower and jump throws it. <laughs> Man, they're just going B every round and Jing has not adapted yet. Up Omrik? Is that Ulrik on a different account? I need, I need. He loves this nade. Oh! This guy is just getting laid out, bro. Unlucky. <laughs> he does that nade every time, though. The jump throw nade. Ooh, blind ulting showers? Oh my god. I'd be fucking pissed. Oh my god, he's dead. Dude! Jing is just getting targeted, right? Like, oh my god. Sova ult, Razel. This guy's getting fucked over. Oh, fuck. Nice. Nice. No util needed. Let's go. Jing is back, baby. Repositioning elbow because they don't have smokes is pretty good. Oh, that insta jump satchel's out. He could be inside if you got insane timing. See, this is good tech, chat. This is good tech. When you get the kill, you want to insta satchel, like insta double satchel to get out. But notice how he does it by jumping. I'm assuming you get a little bit more distance here. This is like his like favorite position, it seems. He just plays U-Haul until they have Brimble, and then he plays back a site. Oh. What? Wait, Jing just... Oh. Yeah, this was an interesting round. So he doesn't even use his nade to counter the A hit. He uses- he like- he peeks late to get the kill and then nades after. I wonder if that's just because he got naded off though. I kinda like this satchel on top tank. He does it a little bit further away. Jump spots for U-Haul? I don't know. I don't know if that's tech or not that jump- jump off tank to see U-Haul. It's interesting that Jing hasn't played B a single round. He just rotates B every time, but he never plays on B. Ooh. They have no flash, so he can go wide. Boombot. You just gonna boombot and leave? Uh, he, he doesn't want to go hookah alone because he's scared of the, the shotgun and the raise nade through TP. Made for elbow. Come side, come side. One out, one out. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. This guy's frenzy was so good though. Come side, come side. One out, one out. Come out. Empty, empty, empty. I like the brim smoke that the enemy team come threw. Side, oh, they threw both, one out, one both of them actually. He threw smokes on both ends. So they, they could flood? Those are good the brim smokes. Yeah, those brim smokes won them the round. Those defense smokes. Go, go, go. Nade out spawn. I'm taking on the elbow, elbow one. Oh. Oh. Wait, this hookah guy is insane. Rank one for a reason, I guess. I see this a lot too, though. Even when uh, in VCT, like the raise entries, typically they don't even entry site when they come from long. They go up here and post. Like Zekin's entry in VCT, I think he like nades somewhere site and he'll just double satchel up here. Whoops, I fucked it up. 
He double satchels up here, and this is how he entries. I need to try that more. Go eat two beer bag. Bye, big actor. See you. Yep. I already know this, but I'll just point it out for people that don't know. If you have shotgun, you start right side short, you jump throw a nade for U haul, and then you get close and then double satchel and the nade expires. Like that. Yep. That's awesome. I already knew he was going to do this, but yeah. I love how it works instantly. Uh, preferably, Rio. But it doesn't really include the raffle bot, so I don't know how we're going to. Oof. <clears throat> Nothing too crazy here. Boombot left, nade right. Boombot goes left, and he pops all to kill the guy on the left. Isn't all Jing doing ranked to fight people? Not necessarily true. Seeing his pathing and his util is nice. It doesn't seem like he likes to commit hookah. Anytime he knows there's a guy hookah, he just uses util and then he goes back to long. Like right there, I would have went, I would have went into hookah and take take fights. But yeah, he went back to his team. And yeah, he, there, there's that double satchel I was talking about. He got on top side to hold the spawn smoke. Oh, I mean, it's kind of a good spot. Very clean. He had the read too. If we lose this, I'm done, guys. Ding, ding, one HP, one HP. Left, left, left. Just mark, just mark. He's one hit. Reloading. Just hold me, hold. Last player standing. <gasps> what? Oh my god, guys, I'm done. Wow. How we lose that? He's ding. Wow. Clutch. I mean, that jet's rank one for a reason, I guess. Nowhere to run. Go get him. Out. Looks like he's going hookah this round. If he dies, it's because he went hookah. Oh, he took a close wall peek here. Oh, rank one diff, rank one diff. What? How does that jet get that kill? Oh. <laughs> this is a team diff, like holy shit. If I was playing this game, I'd be like, holy, like what can you even do to win this game? You have two guys and nine kills and one guy with four kills. This guy's almost penta negative. That's tough. That is tough. I think we'll careful with Mohuka. I think that's kind of a useless boom bot, but he loves going up here. Oh. Mid side, mid side. Game over. Oh! Wait, imagine, chat. Mid side, mid side. He, he, he goes long after he shows hookah pressure. I'm not sure either. That's definitely a big difference though, this game is. After he shows hookah pressure, he just goes back long. Like he throws his boomba and nade and he doesn't commit into hookah. And I'm assuming, oops, whoops. I'm assuming he's not going hookah because he's scared of the TP. That's my assumption. Like he, he doesn't want to like use his util hookah. And nade. And then just get jet smoked on or naded and, and get TP'd and die. So I think he's just like showing pressure hookah to get the fight. And then he'll just rotate back. To, to long to go with his teammate so he doesn't die to the TP. I'm assuming that's why he's just doing it. And then every time he's gone, satchel he'll satchel up here and hold spawn run out. out. Interesting for show. Sure. Alright, so what do we learn from Jing's defense? Jing's defense, he literally plays U-Haul or back tank every round. He didn't play B at all this game. Which I've seen other VODs where he plays B, so maybe it's just a this game thing, but he likes to play here and then peek short. And then if they come up short, he'll nade right here. 
pretty simple. So far, so far this game's been pretty simple. Yeah, and then if they go B, he just quick rotates and then try to flood. And when he goes B, he does his jump throw nade here. Let's see the difference here. Well, actually, I want to see this jump throw nade first. Because normally when I do this nade, I just run through it like this. Okay, so mine lands around front sight like this. Okay, let's see. When he jump throws, he does it like this. A little bit deeper. So jump throw if you want it deep long. And then just run through if you want it front sight. Whoops. So, you can do this with any shotgun. On this round, I think he specifically jumped on the box to avoid spam. But you jump through the nade, and then you can just double satchel. Or maybe he jumped on the box to get closer, you think? Worth practicing.